pretty people. So, um, I was thinking, with diet diseases rising up the top, displeasing stories about failing crop, there's so much we don't know, yet so much we don't show. Wastage and so much food that we actively throw. Can't we be sane, just a little humane? Try to bring change to this atrocious bane. Where there's food, there's happiness. Smiles wide and no more illness. Because children today are the first generation predicted to live lives shorter than their parents. Does it make sense? We don't want it to. Can we bring a change? Oh, we're about to. It's easy to lie and pretend to need, but tough to stand and actually heed. We talk about miracles. Here's one right now. It's really happening. So take part somehow. G20 countries targeted for cause to sign a petition. Round applause. Compelling for practical food education around the globe in every curriculum. Isn't that hard? You know that's not right. So why sit still when you can fight? Here's to Food Revolution Day. Supporting self-help and family care. Here's to nutrition and knowledge. Sign it and share. Hey, what's up guys? I hope you liked that video and if you did, I urge you to urge yourself and your friends to sign this petition for Food Revolution Day. What this petition does is compel curriculums around the globe to include practical food education. This is teach children how to grow their own food, cook it and also take care of themselves and their future families. Why not do something good for once? So sign this petition and share it with your friends. Here's to Food Revolution Day. Until next time, bye. Okay, if you like the video, please subscribe to the channel because she's really awesome.